Hi guys! Hi! And welcome to Chains of Our Hands! Um, this is our first video. Uh, or it's not a first video, it's our first episode. And this is a let's play of Crimes and Punishments Sherlock Holmes. TM. TM. And uh, this will be a let's play drunk. We're not drunk yet. Um, We're but working on it. Yeah. Uh, see, it's Friday, and uh, Fridays are special days, so this will be how we celebrate Friday playing Crimes and Punishments. Which is also why we're dressed as we are. Yes, it's sort of the gala, the first episode. Yes! It's very exciting. Yes. Okay, are you ready? Yes. To crack some cases? Without further ado, to Hit solve it. some mystery. Okay. Yes, yes, please. So we cheated. Yeah. It happens. Yeah. In memory of the Ukrainian Heavenly Hundred. It might be a Ukrainian uh, produced game. You are think? You, uh, you no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was actually pretty funny. I just. <laughs> just me. I just had an accident. <laughs> awesome. So, are you a big Sherlock Holmes fan? I am. From movies, TV series, or the books? Well, I have to say the TV series? Sure. Probably. Well, I read some extracts. I have a master degree in literature, so I should have read everything, but I didn't. Um, don't tell anyone. Can you name one Sherlock Holmes case? I can name one. Yeah, me too. I think it's the same one. Try. It's the one with the dog. The Hound of Baskerville. Yes. It's the only one I can. <laughs> uh, okay. It's Let's the only her. one I've read, actually. Oh, you read it? It's not cool. that long. I read that one. Crime and Pun. You're very loud. I'm sorry. It's the alcohol. <gasps> there he is. That's us. Okay. So I'm gonna take first turn. So yeah. I'm gonna move the mic. Yeah. Okay, move the mic the other way. <laughs> I need to get to the keyboard. <laughs> Thank you. We'll make a decision then. Well, I'm not saying you've tried to sabotage me, but. Holmes, will you stop that? He's so. Calm sensitive. down! Fine, be okay. Look, I'm just gonna do like this, so. You'll be in the mix as well. Hello, Sherlock! I love you! I don't know why I said that. Well, it's not. Stop you know what you said, it's the accent. Is that you, Watson? Yes, of course it is. And you almost Oh, so that's Watson. Nonsense. I was aiming for the vases. Oh, cool, calm and collected, huh? It's a great beard. Watson, quiet, please. I'm trying to concentrate. He's not bothered. Stop. Clinging handcuffs. Who could it be? Policeman. Inspector Lestrade. Ah, Bitches. Lestrade. What is it this time? He can see me. Well, here it is, and it's a good one, Mr. Holmes. Gentlemen, I don't like the Jane. the design on the strat. He could be a bit more, you know, like a sailor, most probably. And when I do like yeah. this, I mean, oh, I get Mr. it. Holmes, I get it. Okay. Could you? She gets it. It's the only <clears> exercise I've My had problem with, with him is that he looks a little too much like Mimo, Watson. I can't really. Yeah, me. Yeah. I couldn't think of a better me too. You're out I think the same as you. Cool. Given you were blindfolded, that was very good. Can I have a try? Am I the only oh, sane one here? Oh, a good thing about celebrating right Friday night, better. party night, in your fancy black dress at home. Black. You can like totally, okay, maybe you can't tell or see, but you can like years wear an these socks and, much <laughs> and nobody would know. Retired in that was a lot of work. A yeah. I went to the gym today. So. Oh, shit. He Near went to Sussex. Sussex. Okay, he's been dead. He okay, he's been dead. For a hundred years. Has the investigation he's been dead? Begun? I fucked yes. up, man. <laughs> okay. He's fucked fact, up and kept fucking so up. It was an avalanche. I prefer you to join me down there. <sighs> Give me half an hour to prepare, Inspector. Take your time and join you me there. Brush my teeth. I have to go through the yard first. The many men struck. Sherlock Holmes, not me. What have they done this time? They robbed a powder reserve. I'll meet you at Woodman's Lee, Mr. Holmes. I should have Mrs. Hudson here. 
I also have several appointments that I must keep this afternoon. I shall go alone then. <laughs> well, fine. fine, lone wolf. Uh -huh. My analysis table. Actually, it is useful for my work. Wolves are pack animals, so they wouldn't be alone. It's actually a really stupid term. This is where I keep my. Pe you could be a lonely falcon. My archive. But would that be extraordinary? It isn't the needed. whole term for lone wolf? Isn't that because it's extraordinary? Can we just for... play the game? Okay. <laughs> well, I think you kind of started this discussion. No, I just say that it's I extremely stupid to say a lone wolf because a wolf wouldn't be alone. Well, is, and that's it would never operate on its own. <laughs> no, but isn't that? No, never mind. Wardrobe. We you don't to... believe me? No, I'm just saying. Watch that... some goddamn Animal Planet. No, I believe you that they would die or something. But I'm just. Can saying you play that... while talking? So this is the morning gown. No. See you later. Maybe later. I like this one with the gold actually, but I think wasn't there a gray suit at some point? Oh, you like the green one, didn't you? Yeah, but we can we can use. I just I really love that one. Then we'll choose the gray one. I was just saying that with the whole wolf thing. Bixby, he's a lone wolf. He's a fairy tale wolf. Okay, hat and hair, the other way around. That's bad. Yeah. No. Bad. No. Worse. Nah. <sighs> Dr. Phil. No. Nah. No. Yes. Or you just check out. No. But that's the. Isn't that like. No. Okay. Maybe that one. The hipster hat? I want the top hat. Yeah. It feels like a top hat Friday. Glasses, no glasses. Like. Gala. Yeah, he I don't know be why this for the occasion. What's going on down there? Nothing. Okay. Facial hair. Oh. Out. Let's solve some crimes. Crime writer. Is it because you're afraid you're not gonna be, you know, your voice not gonna be in that you're so loud? <laughs> because you can just. Yes, I thought it was very um, subdued before. I like it when you're loud. I'm just teasing you. You're not being mean. Yes, but I'm always mean. Mean drunk. Well, this is not my mean drunk. And <laughs> <laughs> you of all people should know this. Yes, I have, I have evidence of that. Yeah. That was funny as fuck. Can I curse? Sorry. Mr. Holmes, probably gonna shouldn't. Come on. This is gonna be a lot of cursing, I'm sorry. I think our audience will be, you know, in tune. It seems that the garden was well maintained. In tuned? Well, in terms of, you know, figuring out that this is the way the language barriers. Yeah. Do. Don't do drugs, kids, and don't watch this. But curse as much as you want. Motherfucker. Land around Stone Pathway. Oh, what about that guy? He's the killer. Sup, dude? No, he's <gasps> Footprints. He was a policeman. Oh, Police you're so cool. I didn't see that. Black magic. Black magic woman. Something is rotten in Denmark. In Sussex. Show Holmes. Okay. Come on. I thought he played that very cool, the policeman, like, meeting Sherlock Holmes and just going, Mr. Holmes. Yeah, Mr. Holmes. I can't Mr. be bothered. Holmes. Have you noticed how, you know, all British people are sort of, like, always talking like they have biscuits in their mouths? Like, <laughs> <laughs> biscuits. <laughs> the queen. Water. <laughs> Play. <laughs> We're just discriminating. Sorry, UK. I love, love I love the UK. We're anglophile. Come on, Denmark. It's just like... If UK is like Middle Earth, then Denmark is the Shire. We're so close. What's more? My condolences, Mrs. Thank you, Mr. I have family.
family in Germany, so it's okay for me to talk about it like that. Okay, so we can do two things here. We can ask her a lot of questions. Yeah. Okay. And we can uh, and we can inspect her. Okay. Feel her up. <laughs> Sexy body. She's got jungle fever. I didn't know this was called a cameo. No, me neither. But I guess it's me a neither. face. So yeah, it makes sense. <laughs> yeah, we can keep calm. <laughs> She's a Catholic. With a vengeance crest tit. Ooh, tit. I get it. I didn't. Titties. <laughs> no. Stop saying titties <laughs> to me. Okay, should we calm her down at first? Like, yeah. calm yourself, woman. Yeah. She looks distressed. She, she looks anything but calm. <laughs> She's so... You have indeed oh. suffered a great loss, mm -hmm. Mrs. Garrick. Nevertheless, I believe it would be less of a burden for you soon. Because your husband yes. died. Life with Peter was never easy. Oh. But he was still my husband. Sorry. You Girl, you're better off without him. When you first met him upon your return from Plymouth. Yes, Mr. Holmes. Oh, oh. How do she you? don't need a man to make it happen. Quick time event! Oh! Uh, how do you know about Plymouth? See you again? Plymouth. Plymouth. Okay. I hate the alcohol vermouth. Mm hmm. <laughs> face. I'm thinking. Okay. Just say well kept garden. No, no, that's not it. We don't know how she went to how they met in Plymouth because they have a kept garden. <laughs> I'll try to say well we Sherlock Holmes we look like for the hidden stuff that nobody else knows. No, but I think this is so well hidden in the well kept garden that I don't think you see you the possibilities. The no, like I am. I'm very limited to sanity. <laughs> well, reality is a nice place, but you wouldn't want to live there. The shortest this is a good drink, the from to Spain is from Plymouth. I made myself. I believe that you met Peter Carey as a young sailor there. Let's just stay focused. Mm. Soon afterwards. We are only like 12 minutes in. Wow. Uh, yeah, just pick that one. <coughs> okay. Can you tell and then be like, anything unusual happened that night? Yeah. Bitch. If this had been like I'm Elaine O'R, it had just been, you are lying! I thought nothing would Well, at first it would have been like... <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> Sandra will remember this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, uh, it was a disappointing ending, though, right? Yeah. On the of the I was like, is that it? Well, Peter is that all there is? Is that all there is? Usually, Usually, whenever that happened, he'd stay all night drinking in his cabin before passing. I don't know about you, but that sounds really nice. Yeah, I was Alone thinking. in a cabin, drinking, having a gay old time. He was just mad because she, she didn't want to drink Look with at him. her. Look at her. She doesn't even care. No, oh, she's stone cold, man. Look at her eyes. She's so calm. She did it. Twice. Okay, just press something. Do you remember? <laughs> Twice. <laughs> she did it. Twice. In the morning, at around <laughs> seven o'clock, I, I noticed, noticed the cabin door was open. <laughs> but I didn't go oh God, you got scared. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm in it. At around ten o'clock, I dare have to glance in through the door and... Oh, oh dear. dear. Was that affection I saw? No. It was all a play. Did he have visitors? Like a girlfriend? Or is there a gardener? It's such a well-kept garden, though. There must be. Is it a well-kept garden or is it a well-kept garden? <laughs> the garden is very large and uh, well-maintained. Uh, <laughs> I employ someone to look after it. I just, true. I watched Desperate Housewives my and it's just a garden. It it's never just a garden. I didn't hear what you just said. Shh. Was your husband accustomed to receiving visitors? Oh, no. I don't think so. I mean, he didn't really have many <laughs> friends. He lived quite an isolated life here. She's so stressed. He <laughs> Thank you. I'm just waiting for the blood to come from her nose. <laughs> Eleven? <laughs> Eleven? Okay. Sorry, ma'am. We'll be nicer. How? Look at how she's sitting. Like, all twisted and evil. Do you know Look at her hair? The crooked man. <laughs> it's like... Well, it's being held down <clears throat> by religion. See oh. the cross? It's 
a very heavy I cross to bear. In nomine Patria et Filii et Spiritus Sancti. Deus vult. Thanks. So where are we going? Okay, so we're going to <gasps> the cabin. You can run? In the woods. You can always run with the shift button. We looked at this, didn't we? You didn't tell me that. These footprints appear to be Ooh. quite what? large. I didn't lie, just withhold, withheld some information. You didn't play that long. Peter Carey's body is inside the cabin. We took care not to touch anything. It's like a domino. Good man. Okay. Open Sponge. the door. Come on, it's too slow. I'm sorry. The door is locked. What? Wait just a moment, Mr. Holmes, and I'll open it. I locked it yesterday to ensure that no one should enter the cabin and tamper with the evidence. Ah, good thinking. Hello, hello, hello. I don't like what that. What is it, mm. Lestrade? I don't like Lestrade. That someone has tried no, to he's fishy. It, Mr. Holmes. Let me see. It's like he doesn't want the so uh, the the cases to. He be did it. He did. And That's then the he ate the nachos in celebration. The nachos. I'm just thinking if you killed one, and you got away with it, your celebration meal, it should be something easy but still satisfying. Nachos. You speak the truth, These my friend. I always do. You're right. Someone tried to force open the door. <coughs> I swear these scratches were not here yesterday. Well, I know he's Sherlock Holmes and all, but sometimes he's like saying stuff, and I'm thinking, well, well duh. He's not the man for the I job. have a mystery for this you to solve. This lock is not a difficult one. Perhaps he did not have the right tool. Oh. <laughs> You're burning through these like fire. I know. It's like one. The first one is always like demure. And then the other one is just holy shit heated. Oh, that doesn't look good. What a terrible way to die. Well, you said it first. Okay, do you want the apricot or the pineapple? You put the lime in you put the lime in you. No, that's coconut. Pineapple. Okay. Midnight my fritters. Put the lime in the coconut, drink it all up, and put the lime in the coconut. Boots! With Peter the fur in the fur, no. The whole club would be her. Could we be stealing a dead man's shoes? Old navigation instruments, nothing interesting. Thank you. Don't drink it all at once. No fun. Okay, investigate. <clears throat> yes. Mm. The ship's logs of the sea unicorn. That's a nice title. You know, for a boat, the sea unicorn. If you had a boat, what would it be called? Unicorn woman! <laughs> Which would make a kick ass song? <laughs> okay. The tooth of a sperm whale. Probably Do you know why it's called a sperm whale? I have a pretty good idea. Well, it's not that. <laughs> It's actually pretty boring. Why is it called the sperm whale? It's something to do with the oil in its head, which they use for, you know, burning candles and stuff in that time. It's called sperm oil. <clears throat> Am I just really juvenile or is it a little bit misleading? Maybe both. It is. My story doesn't really explain why it's still called sperm. I just told you where the oil was. <laughs> I bought it. This place is not covered with dust, like the rest of the shelf. <gasps> An da, da, da. Here. It was larger than a book, a box or a small chest, perhaps. I think it's a chest. Yes. <laughs> <coughs> cool. Sorry. Don't be sorry. I'm not a lady. Someone drank yes. from this glass recently. Who would drink of dirty glasses? <clears throat> Someone who is very thirsty. A guy. <laughs> is it going to be that kind of channel? Fuck off, dude. No, I love men. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Paris is the end of it. I love men. <laughs> yeah. No. no. <laughs> Come on. Fuck you, frogware. And Hungary. Hungary? I didn't mean the last part. But the I hate puzzles. So this is kind of a 3D thing. <gasps> and I don't know how scent works. But apparently... So this is... Could it be... Okay, fun fact. While Sand resolves this puzzle, which could take a while, um, this Friday is not just any Friday. Did you just... What? Actually, <coughs> this Friday in Denmark, where we're from, is uh, a very special day indeed, because this is J-Day. And J-Day is, uh, is, is uh, a very special Christmas day. And the J stands for the first letter in the Danish word Jul, or Jol, um, which means Christmas. <laughs> and, uh, well, this is exciting stuff. Yeah, I know. I just, I've... <gasps> Motherfucker! You... You got it. How fucking precise do... I'm calm. I'm calm. I don't care. It's so, just a game. It's just a game. I don't care. I'm just saying that Denmark can be pretty small. Yes. But quite strong and very popular. You did it! You just had to change the perspective. What a metaphor for life, motherfucker. You curse a lot. I'm sorry. Too much actually. Sorry. But you fixed it! You solved I fixed it! it. And I didn't get to finish my J Day story. Sorry, J Day. No, I'm just saying that Denmark is a really great country, even though it's small, because we have, you know, holidays like celebrating the J Day, the f day when the first Christmas beer is launched. And everyone goes out and drink and have their ale, and everyone is happy. And we're sitting here gaming. Not being out with friends celebrating Christmas. We're friends. Yeah, we are. And maybe we should go out for a beer later. We could, we could. But now we have to solve a crime. Okay, Peter carries clothes. Pool of blood. Okay. There's a lot of blood. <gasps> Murder object. Rotate the object in any direction. This wooden handle is plain and solid. <laughs> Look at stuff like that. Where I'm like, well... This blood is from the pool underneath the dead body. Peter Carey tried to defend himself with this knife, but he did not succeed. Well, obviously he didn't succeed. No. Um... J.H.N. are probably the initials of the owner of this notebook. Having a very dull moment. Hmm. The pattern of the blood stain oh. indicates that the notebook was not lying on the floor prior to the crime. Now we're but talking. This is investigating. After the death of Peter Carey. Hmm. Oh, but please. Oh, God. Numbers. Should we write this down? No, I think he, he might make a note of it. This might be number Success. These abbreviations mean something, but what? You're not telling me that we're supposed to figure out what that means. Because if it's something with numbers... I don't remember. Peter Carey was impaled to the wall by a wailing harpoon. Okay, B. We got clues! Okay, find a pair of related clues and they will form a... Okay, bye. A deduction. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, this is kind of nice. Break in a tent and maybe notebook. Ah. Uh, they make a clue. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, combination track down the guilty party. Okay. An ambush. Must be made tonight to see if the break in attempt will be repeated. This is actually really nicely done. Yeah. Huh. Someone was here yesterday. 
They attempted to force the door to gain entry. Okay, so he's close. Peter Kelly was fully dressed. He was not caught by surprise. It is possible that he knew his murderer. Well, there were two Maybe. glasses, so he might have said, "Hey, dude." Yeah. The weapon fully what about a drink? penetrated the body. I'm the drunk. force of the blow was immense. Okay, so it was someone strong. Very strong. I'm thinking, is this a good place to stop? Because we're at 25 minutes. Yeah. Let's uh, let's take a rest. Do we? Is there any? Ooh, right. there's the bottle. A sailor's drink. It's Cheers on that, man. Well, when in Rome, rum. <laughs> <laughs> but sure, yeah. Let's uh, let's pause. Yes, but uh, thank you so much for watching. Those of you who hasn't escaped yet or run away, um, thank you for staying with us. And uh, remember to subscribe. There will be a button right here. And give us a like. Yes, right here. Right? Yeah. <laughs> See you soon.